Hello once again, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Lenario here as always. Welcome back. I think we're in the home stretch here. Um, I'm going to do the middle one, but first I want to take a look around the cabin. They haven't, haven't picked up any new cards. What do you have to say? Arg, oh, the agony. Arg, oh, the agony. Arg, oh, the agony. All right. Keep doing that. Oh, there's more. There's another tooth. Can't interact with you at all. Erg. I know I've seen things come out of that painting. The cards are placed just so. Well, I can't get the cards, though. Seems to be pretty random as what cards I get. I think I gotta get this pack here. Get the extra stuff. Um, definitely the scissors. Oh, I only get the one? Your eyes affix themselves on the small cabin. It's warm light a beacon in the impressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin marked the end of your travail. Travails. <laughs> oh. Okay. I'm a little, little worried here, guy. Oh, it's pretty. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Fuck, that scared me. Steps away from the strange cabin, you are presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my boons to just any traveler. If you are able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. Trial of the Find. The three drawn cards must include a card with a waterborne sigil. Not that one. Trial of the Skins. The three drawn cards must include a pelt card. Trial of the Winged. The three darn drawn cards must include a card with the Airborne Sigil. I don't think I have any pelts. I think the one I would have most luck with is this one. Let the Trial of the Winged begin. A Raven is a card with the Airborne Sigil. Nice. Forgot I had the Golden Pelt. I will grant you one of my most powerful boons. Cards that dramatically alter the game and you don't even need to draw them boon of the forest. You will start a battle with grand furs on all of your spaces. The boon of goat's blood. You will start a battle with a black goat on the board. The boon of the magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose any card in your deck to draw. Yeah, I want that one. That one seems the best. We will repeat that once more. Trial of rarity. The three drawn cards must include a rare card. The Trial of the Swift. The three drawn cards must include a card with the Sprinter Sigil. The Trial of the Finger. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. What? If you have a ring, you pass automatically. Can I hear these again? No, I gotta choose. Uh, let's do the ring one. Let the trial of the ring begin. Oh. Because I'm a dumbass. Not a single ring. Failure. I thought I just got to choose three more powerful cards. Never mind. Ah, uh, this is less beautiful. You managed to get a boon. This may be a fair competition. Okay, guy. Oh, jeez. You took your time out there. And I'm itching for another game. Are you ready to play? It's like an amalgamation. I hope you are 
adequately prepared. All I need is my Benario. I get my Benario, I'm good. Perhaps one more to be safe. So, come on, dude. Why do you gotta be a dick? Amalgam. I feel like if I choose Benari out of the gate, I'm gonna get whacked hard because of it. Yep, that's what I thought. Shit. So I just lose immediately. You made it so far. Yeah. Dude, that's that was hard. Your death card. Beautiful. Though it could use some detail. Please choose a card to draw the cost from. from rabbit pelt. A cost of free from the rabbit pelt. Use its power and health. Remember, six and fourteen, obviously. Now choose a card from which we will extract the sigils. Do the long elf. A sigil sprinter and a sigil of touch of death from the long elf. I never did ask your name. Bean, bro. Any good card has a portrait. Goodbye. Sick. All right, I think I gotta figure out the painting. Yeah, so close that last one. I doubt you'll make it as far. What is that? Try to stay focused. Your starting deck. All the way at the beginning. What did I get myself into with this game? <laughs> I don't know what that does. But you best believe I'm going to grab it. Alright, I guess we just jump right back into the combat of everything. Take a picture, it'll last longer. Alright. Casey, who's Casey? That's not one I made, is it? I don't remember. I don't think I did a Casey. You came upon the old woodcarver who first her intense gaze upon you. After an overlong moment of silence, she moved to offer her carvings. I like this one. The gray haired woman slightly, silently collected her carvings and left. And now we're into a totem fight. Wolves with flying defense. AC, what do you do? I wonder if that's a reference to one of the developers or something. Oh, 
just get as much out there, right? And these early fights are really easy. All right. What can we get here? Come on, Benario, Benario. Ooh, corpse maggots. The inevitable maggot. They will lurch forth from your hand when your creatures are killed. If a creature that you own perishes by combat, a card bearing the sigil in your hand is automatically placed in its place. Sweet. Let's do you, I guess. I got to go on to this one. Swimming wolves. Oh, this is going to be a bunch of beans. sure but it's the only place it, not not the only place I can put it I guess but that was a horrible place for me to put it. I don't know why you guys let me do that stalemate as far as resources go. Yes, I think you've got me this time. I want to carve out my eye. I want to get the eyeball. Oh, no, I should have saved that. That does a lot. Yeah, give me this so you can give me my eye. I think that was a mistake. I immediately regret that decision. Would you like to replace the lost eye? Yeah, you lost. Yeah, I would. Give me the magic one. choice is final. I don't think there's anything new with the cuckoo clock. Not new with the cuckoo clock, new with the eye. Uh, do I see anything in here? You feed him once more, that should do it. He has no idea what you have up your sleeve. Yeah, you know, I'm really working on that. I should have I should have saved that. That eyeball. Hot tomatoes. Get bones. Because I feel like my last one, like I, I was struggling because I couldn't get stuff out because I I had a big pile of bones, but I couldn't get the blood. The decrepit woodcover appeared before you. She moved with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Oh, you know, I want that one. That's a good one. You launched down to place her offering in your pack. When you looked up again, the ancient woman had vanished. I feel like the squirrels are a good one to have that totem with. Because you're going to sacrifice them anyway. A lucky draw. Yeah, Casey.
I will draw a card, Jesus. <laughs> Test total misplay, but I think that worked out pretty swimmingly. Come on, Benario. Kaminsky? Frozen creature is placed opposite to an empty space. A card bearing this will move to that empty space. So he does... He's basically a 1-1 one, one that will move to a defended place. No, I'm taking the Kingfisher. The warm light of a campfire was a welcome sight. Though the ten hungry eyes around it dampened the greeting. Warmer creature by the fire? Enhance its power? Said one. Enhance its power by one. I feel like the Kingfisher would be a good one to have. So he's, you know, he's a flying swimming boy. Get him to be a little bit stronger. He's 2-1. You had an idea. Why not warm your creature by the fire for just a moment longer? One of the staring survivors took a step closer. This would be risky. Push your luck or pull away. Yeah, let's do it. Let's just... Oh. Before you pull away, one of the survivors left on the Kingfisher. Alright. Another jabbed it with a spear. He looked away as a grotesque feeding frenzy ensued. Blood and bones flew left and right as you retreated from the scene. I should have just taken that back. Well, lesson learned. You may keep the bones. Thank you. At least. That was a mistake. Alright. Past a massive empty bowl, surrounded by heaps of unidentifiable giblets and scantlings. It seemed the bowl was designed for a dog. But what earthly hound would require a meal of that size? It, where's that hound of mine? Squirrel. <laughs> Boss time, eh? Yeah, something like that. Gotta get that pack mule. Draw a squirrel. There's gold in them cards. Gold! I've struck gold! Greetings. Hey, dude. What's up? So I gotta wait until... Alright. Are you sure? I mean, I guess. You gotta put yourself there. the thing, man. I don't exactly have new cards to play with. Do I still win? Do I still get the cards? In the pack mule? You will not perish quite yet. I guess I don't get those cards. Amoeba, Mantis God. Child 13. I'm going to take Child 13. I feel like having that resurrection thing is really useful. Wiping the dust from your trousers, you returned to your journey. A moment. Tepid water flooded your boots. Lies swarmed around you. You had entered 
the wetland. All right, right into this one. Spooky. Trial of power. The three drawing cards must have at least four attack power combined to pass. Three drawing cards must have. Uh, I guess the blood one. I don't think I'm gonna get it though. No. Failure. I have a feeling this is not going to be the one for me. Oh, wait, no, this is going to take a card. Can I just not do it? <laughs> I just don't have the cards. I'm just, this is not going to end well. Dead. Yikes, son. <laughs> it's just not my game. Nope. <laughs> I think I really screwed up using the eyeball and not getting the pack mule. When will a worthy challenger appear? Honestly, man, I don't know. I don't even know if I am that worthy challenger. I gotta get cards, though. That's for certain. Bloodhound. Oh, frog. Oh, he pooped out a little thing. I don't want to do this. I'm trying to keep my cards. I guess the bullfrog, right? Yes, more power. I think I just gotta restart this run anyway. Though I like this. don't know but that is all the time i have for today ladies and gentlemen thank you so much for watching and as always have a lovely day